All right, let's just have a quick look. Now, now that I'm established, um, last time I was here was September last year. I did a video about it. This is St. Peter's Church at Waltham Coat. And Waltham Coat is a medieval village that has appeared in the in about 1400 due to um, the land not being not very good and a plague. So the, all that's left is the church. This is this um, five pane uh, east facing window, which is supposed to be a, a, a notable uh, feature. Um, oh look, mysterious door. Hang on, let's, um, yes, I might take a still of that. Okay. Um, yes, I was trying to say um, previously, there is a little green shed with a toilet in it. So I was trying to say previously, when I arrived, I unexpectedly discovered that there's all a load of cows lying down in the in the um, in the churchyard. Um, that was unexpected. That's what I was trying to say. Uh, this is unexpected. Uh, so I was dragging my stuff in. So many trips backwards and forwards, bringing all my luggage in, because it's quite a walk. So it's all the way down here. I wish I could get the bike in here and up here, but I can't do it. I'll try to do it. Well, I'll show you in a minute. Let me get down there. Yeah, they're all here. In that area there, with all these cows all grazing and lying down, and I presume they're trying to shelter from the hill. There they are. Um, between the wall and that head, we can't see them. They're all over there now. Um, but they were lying down because of the heat. It was extremely hot this afternoon. Extremely hot. All of a sudden. Um, worked up quite a sweat just bringing all my luggage in. Anyway, they're all here. They're all lying down on the ground all here, whatever. And I'm walking back and forth and they're looking at me saying, thinking like, you know, what the hell do you want? Well, because I'm camping here, that's what. Anyway. Um, that's where the bike is. Um, if you haven't nibbled anything, that's the only thing I was afraid of. They start nibbling upholster or something, but they don't seem to be doing anything like that. Anyway, yes, I wanted to, um, when I was there last time, I was trying to get it this this gate here uh, if you can open that out and I was trying to drive the bike in but the this this tree route is uh, is in the way I couldn't get it over that you know the, I couldn't get the front the front wheel over that tree route otherwise I could drive it in here um, it'll be nice you know even like if I can get it this far you know which halves the distance so I have to walk. It's about six or seven trips with heavy bags and whatever. Battles and forwards. Well, not battles and forwards, but one way. I, rem I remember this from last time, so I brought with me three generous sized carrier bags. We can just heap up with stuff, all the little odds and ends and whatever, all the little fiddly bits. Just heap them up, and then which makes it just easier to carry stuff. It's not like camping where you're camping right next to your tent. You know, you just go and get something when you when you need it. Um, but anyway, uh, let's go back a bit. Anyway, there it is. Uh, that's the that's the west end with the tower and the uh, and as I said before, it seems to be a conglomeration of different architectural styles, which are kind of stuck on um, laterally and the let's say that this is the west end and it's the south end around here is actually the front of it you wouldn't think so now because the road uh, the road goes past which is, which is actually the back of it the, oh, I don't know if you can see it 
between those trees you probably can't see it unless I unless, I, unless I'm gonna do a zoom in is the spire of the Braunston um, church which is just over there that's the a45 over there just over there um, it's now about five to seven in the evening uh, it's still quite warm so you see that the sun's going down um, it's still quite warm um, yeah, yeah it's very balmy at the moment very tropical um, so I've got me like me cargo slacks on and t-shirt Anyway, I'm going to have my tea now. So I had my lunch, which was a felanel, felanel burger, which is like a chickpeas and curry and whatever, uh, and with chips, and it was very nice. And I'm now going to have a quick tea, which is um, which which uh, I bought earlier. Uh, so what? Uh, yeah, I've got sandwiches in here and an apple and whatever and I've got a flask of tea that I made this morning I assume it's all right still um, which reminds me I need to find the the milk powder I've already put the sugar in but I need the I need the milk powder and I'll find it I'm going to want them later yeah um ten light things. There's the other one. Oh, there's the other one. Oh, where's this milk powder? Ah here it is. Okay. So there's my milk powder. Uh give me a flask of tea. And, uh, and that'll be good. Right, well, I'll do it for a minute. I'll just, I can sit out here for a bit more. Well, oh, it's still warm. It is cooler inside the church, so it'll be nice. It should be nice sleeping tonight. Right, I'll leave it there for the minute. Um, uh, maybe do something else tomorrow. I'd like to go out tomorrow a couple of places. If I do, we'll do a maybe do a video then. But for today, tatty bye.